welcome. This isn't an ordinary place that I go. But I, off camera, designed this pretty cool looking house. And I was thinking of doing a tutorial about it. So what we'll need is some oak, some spruce. That will be our basic tools here. So if we go like this, so you place four bits of wood across like that. Then one there, then one there, 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 one there. And this is the basic setup for it. But since this bit here is going to be our entrance, we'll have to go up like this I think it was so if we go over here that's what we want our entrance to look like so these go up too so I'd done that bit wrong which was a fail on my part so then we go up two on all of these except from these corner ones here like so then what we want to do is get spruce wood and go on that's not supposed to be there on the corners you just do that that bit done so now what we want to do is we want to go up two on these bits again except from just one across and then for that bit there you just leave that bit alone so that it's just a fence post that goes up so and then on that bit we leave it because we can't really do that on that bit let's uh, go like that last bit like that and now we bring this up to cover it Uh, wrong one broken. I am recording early in the morning. Wait this sec. It goes up two. So these bits here would be oak. So it's all oak on this top layer. So if we just place these there open it up and then just get rid of them uh, like that yeah I haven't built this in a long time which is why at some pit uh, some bits I'm thinking on what I need to do and now what we want to do Let's get our oak and just top it off. Uh, I'm not sure, shall we? Leave that, it's up to you. I think I'll put a cap over it. If not, you can just leave it like that. But I think like that makes it fit in with the roof more. So over here you just fill them in like so and then you just do what you normally do with a roof like very basically just 
cover it all. Like this. Oh, wrong bit. Yeah. So. And even though we're just doing a basic roof, it comes out uniquely with the, like, the topped off caps, which looks cool with these, because it looks like they're actually doing something. So that's that layer done. And then we go all the w uh then we go all the way to the peak which will be soon I think. Cause it's not a very high roof. Uh, like this. Fail there. There's our roof. Now, what we need is some fences. And jack o' lanterns. Where are they? Uh, there. So, very basically, just pop them in there. I used them because they look pretty cool. Oh, wait, something that I did forget to do is this so that we got our doorway to go like that now we use fences just to break it up a bit like so just put it in all of the joints like so and in here did I put one on top of there I'm not sure if yeah see you can put it like that which gives it that kind of look, but if you put it like that, gives the door a bit more depth. And I did put it on that way on purpose, so that it fitted in more with it, so it gives it more depth. So let's put that there. Now what we want to do is we want to get some oak wood. And basically just outline it. Like this. And then it kind of gives it a bit more variety in colours. like so. Now let's just put that as oak. Let's get a door. Doors are in redstone aren't they? Uh, how would I do this? Like that. Then let's get pressure plates. Just that so that we don't have to be really annoying and open the door every time. We just have to run at it. Now, this is what I done. You don't have to do this. But I completely removed this floor because grass isn't that attractive as a floor. And it kind of gave it a cool look. I'm not sure. You can decide what it looks like. Right, so let's get some of them with levers. And over here. Wait, I need that lever. We don't need this stuff anymore. 
and that. So basically, just dig down two on these. And just place levers there. Levers. You don't have to use the redstone lamps if you don't want to. I just think it looks cool in this. So. There's that. And then... I oh yeah, we need to change that, so we need to get this back. And just give it a birch woods like border, then spruce. And then much. And then this is it done. But what you can add, which I think I added in the other house to the interior, is leaves. Or you can do fences. It's up to you. Like that. Now I think the leaves look quite nice in it. And they're jungle leaves. So let's do one with fences, one with leaves. And this just about wraps up the episode. I might do another one about trying to decorate the inside if you want me to. But so far, that's done. We just built ourselves a strange, unique looking house. That I personally think, uh, thinks that it looks pretty cool. Very unique, I doubt someone's built something that looks like this. Cause I just randomly placed wood and this when I made it. So that about wraps it up. In fact, wait, that's it. Um, where's bone meal? There. Let's just give it a little pathway on the outside. just to make it look a bit more as if it's in the wild pathway made out of gravel why not randomly dig out a little path and set a couple of bits coming off just to give it a bit more of a oldish look like that and bone meal around here and maybe a little tree uh, what one should we go for? oak so let's have a tree right there maybe one right there that's a nice little tree and uh, they're both the same. Let's 
cut this one down. Let's take that down so it just grows faster. Uh, gets rid of by itself as well. There we go. And here we have it. Our own little hole. Well, not a hole, but like a little hut. But first, before we go, let's just add a little lamp to it. And you can't put one there. In fact, I'm not quite keen on that lamp. I prefer these ones. And there we have it. So, goodbye. Have a nice day. See ya.